Hi, I'm Chris Lucas and I thought I'd pluck up the courage and do a video and show you the shirt that I've made for part of my assignment um, for the fashion design course that I'm doing and the assignment was to design and draft a classic style ladies fitted shirt. So this is what I've come up with and I thought I'd show you some things that I like about it and what I don't like about it so much. Um, but overall I'm pretty happy with it, so I thought I'd do this video and take you through um, some components of the shirt. So first off, I'll show you um, the things that I quite like, and we'll start from the top. Really, really happy with how the collar turned out. I think the shape and the size and style for the shirt for my body is quite good, and it's quite in proportion to my body, as you can see. So I think overall that's quite nice. Really, really happy with how the collar points turned out. So check those little babies out. Looking pretty good. Um, what else is there that I like about it? The fit for the neck, if I wanted to put a collar and a buttonhole at the top, my collars match beautifully in the centre. So that's really quite good. Lined up my collar and got a really nice fit and a really nice roll over the collar as well as you can see by the right. So pretty happy with the collar. Next up button placement. Thrilled with my button placement and application. I've got a button going um, at the centre of the bus so no bust gaping there to worry about which is great. Always a big plus especially on a fuller figure like mine. Um, and then I've got them spaced about every four inches apart. And the last one is here, so it covers my tummy up quite well. So, and still gives me a bit of room movement around my hips. So, happy with that. Um, next up, I'll show you the sleeves. The sleeves are quite good, got a nice fit under the arms, a little bit of room there. And I've got a good range of movement through my arms without. <laughs> getting too much lift from my shirt. Um, sleeve cuffs, got the length really well, sitting quite nicely on my wrist. So there's my cloth cuff length and my placket, pretty proud of my placket, coming right to the shoulder point and then I have a smaller button here with a buttonhole going that way and one of the fancier buttons here with a buttonhole going that way. Um, and here's the other one. Might as well show you the both sides. So, yeah. really, really happy with those, how they turned out. Um, sleeve cap ease. I probably could have taken a little bit out of the back here, but I'm not quite sure because when I move my arms like that, I've got plenty of movement and no restriction. So, I think for comfort wise, it's probably pretty spot on. Um, the bus darts are sitting quite nicely, coming through the sides, through to here. They sort of finish around about here and my bus points are here, so that's good. Got centre front darts going through here, gives a little bit of shaping to the shirt, sort of helps give the illusion that I actually have a little bit more shape than I really do. Um, length overall really happy with the length because it comes here which is just sort of where the below the widest part of my hips so I've got a bit of a nice curve on the sides there you probably see that side a bit better so it just sort of comes and sits over that quite nicely so I can get away with wearing a pair of jeans and not have to worry about tummy bulge showing because it covers that better and sits quite nicely over my Bottle. I've got some back waist darts through here, which also helps give a little bit more shape to the back of the shirt. So I'm pretty happy with that. So overall, um, I would honestly have to say this is probably the most comfortable shirt I have ever worn, um, and it also is probably one of the probably better fitting shirts I've ever worn as well. So overall I think I did pretty well. 
Not sure how I'll go with my assignment. I've still got all the written component to do. Um, but fingers crossed, you never know, I might get another high distinction. For my last assignment, I got a high distinction. So, yeah, fingers crossed. You never know. Um, but if not, it doesn't really matter because in the end, I've got a great pattern to make any kind of shirt that I like. And first of all, I thought this fabric was probably going to be a bit loud and leery, but now that I've made it up, I don't actually mind at all. So yeah, I'll stand out in the crowd, but who wants to blend in? Well, no, I don't. So there you go, that's an overview of my shirt. Um, I don't know what else to tell you, except I'm so glad now I've finally plucked up the courage to do a video and to share my progress with you by video instead of just photos. So I hope you liked the overview and I just want to say thank you for all your support and encouragement through my course because it really does mean a lot to me. So big hugs to you. Thank you.